This little guy is an American toad, and today I'm going to show you how to set up an enclosure for him. For most toad enclosures, you need a few main things. The enclosure itself, substrate for the toad to dig in, leaf litter, and a water dish. For this enclosure, I've chosen to use a 20 gallon tank, but a tote with the same square footage also works great. Arguably, the most important part of a toad's enclosure is the substrate. Toads love to dig, so they should have at least enough substrate to bury themselves. For a good, moisture holding substrate, I use a mixture of eco earth and fir bark. Cypress mulch also works great, but I didn't have any on hand. Adding in small bits of mulch or bark into the eco earth can help avoid molding and it also gives your toad more textures to experience when digging. To add eco earth, let the brick soak in water. It uses a lot more water than you might think, so don't be afraid to really soak it. Once you're finished, it should be damp but not so wet that the water pours out when you squeeze it. Next, mix in the bark or mulch. I had about 50% fir bark to eco earth, but you can change the ratio for your own preferences. Mix until it's evenly distributed throughout the eco earth. The next step is adding in a water dish. You want the water dish to be large enough for your toe to soak in, but make sure it takes up less than a quarter of the enclosure. Unlike frogs, which spend most of their time in water, toads mostly stay buried in moist dirt, meaning more ground space is needed than water space. After you've placed the water dish, you'll want to add some leaves. You can use dead dry leaves from outside, but make sure you disinfect them. I personally bought some leaves from PetSmart and they work just fine. The main reason for adding leaves is to provide cover for the toads, but also, if you have a bioactive enclosure, the leaves also provide a food source for isopods. Now that you have the enclosure set up, all that's left to do is to add your toad. If you enjoyed this video or learned something new, please like and subscribe. It's free and helps the channel grow. Thank you so much for all of your support.